this is Pastor Marilyn with G1 Elementary. It is so good to be with you guys uh, today. We just finished celebrating Thanksgiving. Um, and what is Thanksgiving all about, boys and girls? Is it all about eating turkey and mashed potatoes and gravy, eating cookies and pies? No, Thanksgiving is about giving thanks to God for who He is in our lives and for all that He has done for us. Uh, and our scripture for today comes from Psalm 136. It says, Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His love endures forever. Can you say that with me, boys and girls? Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His love endures forever. One more time. Psalm 136. Give thanks to the Lord, for He is good. His love endures forever. And that is one thing I am so thankful for, is God's love. Uh, love means God does what is right for us. I've always known God to always do what is in my best interest and in the interest of people in my life. Sometimes it might not seem like things are going the right way, but God always has a plan. In his great love for us, his unconditional love for us, he does what is best for us. You can always trust that God will because he loves you. Another thing I'm thankful for is my family. I'm so thankful for uh, the husband that God has given me. I'm thankful for my sons. I have two sons and two stepsons. I'm so grateful for all of them. I'm thankful for my work family. I'm thankful for my church family and my football family. And in just a minute, you're going to hear from somebody from each of those families. All right. Now, boys and girls, your assignment for this Sunday is to tell somebody what you are thankful for. All right. Thank you, guys. God bless you. And we'll see you. Logan Smith, what are you thankful for? Well, I'm thankful for my relationship with God. I'm thankful for my wife, the birth of my sons. I'm thankful for my parents. I'm thankful for who I work. And I'm thankful for being a member of Spring Valley Church of God. And I'm sure there's other things that I'm missing, but I'm just so thankful what am I thankful for this year? I'm thankful for many different things. But first and foremost, what I'm thankful for is my relationship with Jesus Christ. For without Jesus, I don't know where I'd be at right now. I'm thankful for my daughter, Sarah Jane, who brings much, much joy into my life. And just the love that she gives back is so amazing. I'm thankful for my church family, for my pastor and the leadership of my church. I'm thankful for um, uh, my family. I'm thankful for my uh, extended family in the Philippines. I'm thankful. I'm thankful for my job that I get to share uh, the gospel with people. I get to pray with people. So that's what I'm thankful for this year. And I'm thankful for you too. What am I thankful for? This year has definitely been a year to think about that. I am thankful for my family. They are always here and always supporting me. I am thankful for my friends. During this time, when I can go outside, I would talk to them all the time and I'm so thankful for them. And I'm thankful for this crazy pandemic. I'm thankful that God blessed me to see this time so that I could take time away from always going to work or always going out to stay home and to really get into God's Word. Those are the things that I am thankful for. Hi, my name's Mike and I'm thankful for my family. I'm thankful for this day. I'm thankful that our sons have the opportunity to play in the state championship game and to be honest, we didn't play football at all in such a crazy mm. year. All right, thank you. Yeah. I'm thankful that we got through this entire season and that we're finally made our way to States. I'm thankful for all the boys that they've stayed healthy. 
and I'm going to be really, really thankful for this whole group and community for supporting our boys and just give them everything you got. So cheer us on. Let's go wild. Yay. Thank you, Stacy. <laughs>